Uh, yes, we did. We did uh, <coughs> reach some uh, common ground today and agreement with respect to the complexity of this issue of terrorist groups. But it's not appropriate for me to announce anything that we may have agreed to together uh, on a bilateral basis, because as Sergey <coughs> just said, uh, we really need to have the whole group take part in that discussion. Um, and so uh, it's appropriate for everybody to contribute to whatever decisions and outcomes there are. But we certainly uh, narrowed down our own thinking about uh, the complexity of it and how one can manage uh, that. We obviously agree that ISIL and uh, ISIL slash Daesh and Al Nusra are absolutely outside of this process, no matter what. Everybody has agreed to that. That's uh, unanimous. Uh, and beyond that, uh, we look forward to the discussion in New York on uh, Friday. Uh, with respect to the uh, uh, announcement or proclamations of the people who came together in, uh, in Riyadh, uh, that, that is not the position of the International Syria Support Group. It is not the basis of the Geneva Communique. It is not the basis of the UN resolution. And we are assured by the members of the International Syria Support Group who uh, were attending that meeting and helping with that meeting and hosting that meeting that that is not, in fact, the starting position uh, because it's a non-starting position, obviously. So for those people who are going to participate, they understand we are participating <coughs> under the Geneva Communique. Uh, and the transition process is geared to try to be taking effect within about a six-month period. That's the current target that has been approved by the International Serious Support Group.